Good morning, America. This is Sergeant Frank with Adopt a Cop USA. And as you can see, it's a very frosty morning. I apologize. I miss the sunrise today because I was on the road for 13 hours yesterday helping out an organization with their program. And, um, Unfortunately, I didn't get back till very late. But what I want to do is talk a little bit about opposition. Because as you can see, it's frozen frost all over the ground across the road. It's about 29 degrees. And you can't appreciate the warmth if you never have the cold. And I was thinking about a time when I was a sergeant going for a particular position and um, one of the people that was in the uh, opposition came up to me and made some very derogatory commentary about my education and my qualifications to be able to get the job that we were both going for. And I said, okay, thank you very much for that. And then I went out and I proceeded to go above above and above and beyond in my quest to attain the position. So the first go around goes and there was three people in the uh, tryout and one, one failed out and it was just me and the person. And we scored an identical score. And according to the rules that the organization put out, whoever had seniority would take the position. That was what the rules are and the union rules and everything else. And exactly what they did was they said, well, we're not going to follow the, the guidelines that we gave you. We're going to, we're going to extend the uh, tryout. We want you to do more. I'm like, okay, what's, what's the next thing? So then they were like, okay, we're going to require you to do a promotion about this particular program that we want to conduct in our city. So I did the same thing. I went out and I met with the representative of the product. I created a training manual with their help. And then I went out and I created a video with all my friends that I worked with at the agency. And they did this all on their own free volition for no overtime, just to come out to help me in my quest to attain this position. And we made an amazing video. It was it was great in, in the, the program. So I come back in and we're, we're doing the final tryout. And I walked in the office. And the guy that's in the, uh, he's in the interview process with me. He's standing there reading my presentation. And I said, well, would you like to see the video? And he kind of laughs. He's like, oh, yeah, right. So... Needless to say, we went and we did the we did the presentation, and I presented my video and everything else, which they actually put on YouTube to show the uh, the citizens what we're doing to help protect them in our city. And the young man came up to me afterwards, and he said, "Sergeant Frank, you didn't just beat me in this tryout. He goes, you destroyed me." And I said, "Be careful." When you call out somebody and their abilities, because sometimes you won't know what their abilities are. And I appreciate that. And I want to thank that young man for doing that, because if he not if he would not have done that, I probably wouldn't have done what I did to attain that position because they gave me the position. Sometimes in life, you have to be thankful for what your enemies do to you whether they steal from you or they throw roadblocks in front of you or they try to prevent you from doing the right thing because that's what they're trying to do. They're trying to stop you from doing the good that you're trying to accomplish. But I'm going to tell you right now from Sergeant Frank and my positioning here in law enforcement for 28 years, evil cannot stop good and negative cannot beat positive ever. So go out today. And be positive in your world 
and do your best to help other people. Please like and share our videos on Adopt a Cop USA official site on YouTube, on Facebook, and our website, myaacusa.org. And help us put the United back in the United States. God bless you and God bless America.